Yo guys, welcome back to another video on the channel and today I'm going to be showing you guys how the battle pass works in Modern Warfare 2 and in Warzone 2. But before we do get into today's video, if you are new around be sure to subscribe to the channel with notifications, turn on so you don't miss any more videos on the channel. If you do enjoy it, smash thumbs up and let me know your thoughts on this in the comments below. But no more messing about, let's jump into it right now. Okay, so you guys might be looking at this new battle pass and thinking, what is going on here? There seems to be so much going on. And basically, all it is is separate it down into different sections. I don't know why this data center keeps popping up. It's really annoying, but I'm going to try to do the video with it because I can't do it without it. So what you basically have to do is these are just set into different sections, right? And in each section, you have four things you have to unlock to unlock the fifth thing, which is the main one. If we come to A1, for example, and click select, you can see that you need to claim all four of these four here. And then once claimed all four, you will get the HS or the HVT blueprint there. And as you can see in the bottom right hand corner, I have 57 tokens. These tokens are what you're going to unlock the stuff with a battle pass for. So for me to be able to get past A1, I need to use four of my tokens to use this one, this one, this one, and this one, which I'll do right now. I'll claim that. I'll claim that. I will claim that. And then I will claim that. Now that I have claimed all four of those, I should have the A4 ready to claim. As you can see, I can now claim the HV, um, T, the A4, whatever it is. And all five of those are now complete. That sector is now complete. What we're going to do is we're going to go back. And as you can see, now that sector is complete, I can move on to a connecting sector so now i can go ahead and finish a2 and then i can finish a4 a7 a8 a9 a12 in any order that they connect or i can go a3 into a6 to a10 to a13 all the way up guys until you do complete everything and you will get this final one here as you can see you get 300 cop points you do get the mortals bane blueprint there as well as the t the, the, the completion skin which is quite cool but that is how the battle pass works this year all the tokens that you do have in the bottom right hand corner just go into the different sectors so whichever sector you might want to go for first you might think, you know what? I want to get the new sniper rifle first. Let me go all the way up. Or I want to go ahead and get the new Bass P first. Let me go all the way to the right. It's entirely up to you, whichever order you want to do it in. It's a bit more down to you of which you are, what you do unlock first, which I quite like. I think that's quite cool. But yeah, that's how the battle pass works. You literally need to go through, to go onto a sector. Again, I'm going to go through, claim all four of these so you guys can see me do another sector with four of my tokens. As you can see, everyone I, I claim a token does go down. We're then going to get that. That is A3 now complete, which will allow me to move on to a5 or a6 which you can see i can now go ahead and unlock the new smg which i'm going to do and then i'm going to go ahead and unlock the new sniper as well i'm going to go both ways so i get both the new guns but that is exactly how the battle pass works for modern warfare 2 and warzone 2 hopefully the video did help you out if it did smash thumbs up subscribe if you're not ready now catch you on the next one in a bit Peace.